Hi, I want to share a great tip with you to keep your lawnmower in top condition. See all this dry dun grass on the blades and the underside? That affects its cutting performance and puts the motor under unnecessary strain. But it's a heck of a job to get off, isn't it? Well, it's not if you follow this great tip. Everybody has a can of this in their shed. It's WD-40 multi-use product. This stuff's great at getting rid of organic matter, such as oils, grease, dried on rugs, and plant matter. All you need to do is make sure the lawnmower's unplugged. Give it a really good generous spray all over the blades. Then leave it for a few minutes and watch all this horrible stuff just come straight off. Like magic, isn't it? Well, it's not magic. It's the famous blue and yellow can of WD-40. It's a real shame when garden power tools get into this kind of state. They never work as well as they should. And if moisture gets into the blades and the motors, it can shorten their life. And who wants to be paying out extra money on power tools when you don't have to? But here's a top tip to help you prolong the life of your trimmers, drills and other things that have a hard life in the garden by using something that you already have in your shed. It's this, a can of WD-40 multi-use product. It's a fraction of the cost of buying new power tools. All you need to do is make sure it's unplugged and give it a really good generous spray all across the blades. Give it a wipe with a clean cloth and not only will that get rid of all the organic matter, it will also lubricate the blades and leave a protective film so it won't rust in the shed. It's the easiest thing in the world, isn't it? To leave your spade like this after you've done a bit of digging in the garden. But the problem is, all this sticks to the metal and then rust eats away at it. So I'm going to show you a handy tip that's going to help you get this really clean and make it last longer. Just grab your can of WD-40 multi-use product from the shed and give it a really generous spray. And grab your cloth and give it a good wipe. And as you can see, it gets it really clean and shiny. Now this also works for secateurs, trowels, forks, and even wheelbarrows. And the best thing about it is it leaves a good protective layer all over. So this spade will look as good as when you put it in the shed when you get it out next time. The trouble with these stainless steel bins is they look fantastic when they're new, but it doesn't take much for them to end up looking like this, disgusting. My wife won't even have it in the kitchen when it looks like this. But fortunately, I have the answer to hand, and so do you. Just grab your can of WD-40 multi-use product from under the sink, give it a good spray, and give it a wipe down. And there you are, good as new. It's also great for stainless steel fridges and splashbacks, by the way. So there you have it, another problem sorted. It's not pleasant when power tools like this get caked up in oily grime. It gets on your hands, it gets everywhere. And most importantly, it means your power tools might not last as long as they should. Now, obviously you can't clean power tools with soap and water, but this will do the trick. WD-40 multi-use product. Just make sure it's unplugged and give it a generous spray. And a wipe, and this will clean up your power tools a treat. And here's the best thing about it. Not only does it lubricate it so there's less wear on the motor, but it also leaves a protective layer so that there's no rust or seizing up, meaning that an expensive piece of kit like this lasts you longer. I always say look after your tools and they'll look after you, but things like this saw won't cut cleanly if it's filthy. This has got roofing tar on, but resin from cutting wood can just as easily clog up the teeth and make it stick. But it's not as difficult as it looks to get it clean. You won't believe this, but WD-40 multi-use product will get rid of all that grime, tar, even resin and bring up your blade as good as new. All you need to do is give it a spray and give it a good wipe. And as you can see, it brings your blade up as good as new. And you'll like this. Because it lubricates, it gives you a cleaner cut without it sticking. And you can put it away like that now, and the WD-40 will protect it from moisture and rust. Beats buying new tools every spring, doesn't it?